Vældig lidt. Hvis vi kan få, for, øh, hvordan fik man et forelsket hjertes øh, musikvideo op på 2000 øh, views, så kommer der tre musikvideoer op i oktober. Så jeg, jeg håber, vi kommer til det. Kom så! Velkommen tilbage til en episode af Red Dead Redemption 2. Get on. Good. And you? Got everything we need. Good. I think we need another man. Charles? I'll go get him. Meet us at the wagon when you can. Sure. See you, Arthur. Ain't that dumb. <laughs> Next time, let the wolves eat all your brains. Then you'll be a genius. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. So you're heading to the wagon now? Soon, yeah. Who did you call a goddamn drunkard? Young shit. <laughs> I got no idea. Hey, Javier. What are you wearing? Bill, you're drunk again. There he is. Hello. How's it all going? Fantastic. Okay. Or, uh, what hey. do you need, Arthur? Oh. I've forgotten what it was now. What's that that means? Just checking you were Damn still it. breathing. I need to sleep. What, Arthur? Ah, don't worry. It can wait. Please, let me go back to sleep. <laughs> Hi, Arthur. Come here a minute. What is it? Can I ask you a favor? Probably not. Very funny. Would you do something, Jack? He seems kind of down. All this upheaval can't have been easy on the poor kid. Why? Because I'm your preferred nursemaid? Because you do what you say. Please? Okay. I'll take him in the morning. Thank you. Come fishing with me. Fishing? Sure. You're right. It's about time that you started to earn your key. Okay. Good. Let's go get your pole then. Now, you do have a fishing pole, don't you? I sure do. Uncle Jose made me one. Good. Well, let's go get it then. Go catch us some fish. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's good, Jack. And that's a soul. Other women, I guess. What do you mean? Just talking silly. It's been a tough few weeks up in that snow. I like the snow. Yes, but not like that. When are we going back to the other camp? The one near Blackwater? Yeah. Well, we're not. This is our spot. For now, anyway. Why? I forgot a storybook there. We left so quick. Well, I'm sure someone can get you another storybook. Really? When? Well, <laughs> we'll see. Got fish to catch first. Yeah. All right. This looks as good a spot as any.
Where should we stand, Uncle Arthur? Down by the shore. Come on, follow me. Just by the water there? Yeah, check. I can't wait to. Bellier the better. Now, cast your line. Swing the rod back over your shoulder and bring it forward in a smooth motion. Use your wrist, not your elbow. Like that? That's it. Good. All we do now, Jack, is wait for a fish to take the bait. How do I know when I've got a bite? Well, if you feel the tip of your fishing rod just twitching, don't yank it yet. That just means one's nibbling. If you feel a hard tug, that's a fish going for the bait, so yank hard to hook it. You've got a bite, Uncle Arthur? There we go. I see. I see. It's a chain picker. <laughs> it's almost as small as you. We should really throw these smaller ones back. Give them a chance to grow up a bit. Can I take a break from fishing? I want to make something. Okay. some of those red flowers. I'll be right back. There! Got him! You see him fighting there, Jack? That's when you gotta be careful. You, you'll break the line. Best to wear him out first before you try to reel him in. Well, seems like he's taking a rest now. I'm gonna try reeling him in nice and steady. This one's a bluegill. <laughs> Not bad. Gotta stick at things, Jack. I know. Fishing sure is boring, Uncle Arthur. I know. Boring as hell. But then, something happens. And you can get food for days. Really? If you're lucky. But until then, you just sit, wait, try not to worry. It's good for you. Good for you? I guess. Huh. All right. Let's see what's biting there. Hey, look at this. The what? This necklace I made. Necklace? For Mama. Sure. What a fine young man. And in such complex circumstances. Arthur, isn't it? Arthur Morgan? Who are you? Yes. Arthur Morgan. Vanderlyn's most trusted associate. You've read the files. Typical case. Orphaned street kid seduced by that maniac silver tongue and matures into a degenerate murderer. Agent Milton, Agent Ross, Pinkerton Detective Agency, seconded to the United States government. Nice to finally meet. We know a lot about you. Do you? You're a wanted man, Mr. Morgan. It's $5,000 for your head alone. $5,000 for me? Can I turn myself in? We want Vanderlyn. <laughs> Old Dutch. I haven't seen him for months. That's so? Because I heard a guy fitting his description robbed a train belonging to Leviticus Cornwall up near Granite Pass. Oh, is that a little old-fashioned nowadays? Apparently not. Listen. <clears throat> this is my offer, Mr. Morgan. 
Bring in Vanderlyn. You have my word, you won't swing. Oh, I ain't gonna swing anyways, Agent. Uh, Milton. You see, I haven't done anything wrong. Aside from not play the games to your rules. Spare me the philosophy lesson. I've already heard it from Mac Callender. Mac Callender? He was pretty shot up by the time I got to him. So really, it was more of a mercy killing. Slow, but merciful. <laughs> Enjoy being a rich man's toy, dear. I enjoy society, flaws and all. You people venerate savagery, and you will die. Savagely, all of you. Oh, we're all gonna die, Agent. Some of us, sooner than others. Good day, Mr. Morgan. Goodbye. Enjoy your fishing, kid. <coughs> While you still can. <laughs> Who were they? Who were they? No one to worry about, no one at all. Come on, let's pick up your things and get home. It's getting late, Jack. Your mother would be worried. Let's head back. Can we go now, please? Time to go, boy. I don't like it here anymore. Why did you lie about where Uncle Dutch is? Because, well, because those are disagreeable men, and I don't want them to hurt him. What did they mean about Matt? Is he in jail? Uh, no, I don't uh, think so. I hope he's just fine where he is. Like I said, don't worry about them. The world is full of disagreeable men. That's why you got all of us. Protect you. Folk like them. Now, how about that necklace you made? You still got it, right? Yeah, I got it. Good. <coughs> Did you like fishing? It was okay, I think. It's a lot of waiting around. It is. There you are. How you boys get known? Great. We caught a fish, and I made you this necklace. Ain't that pretty? Not the luckiest. Did you thank Uncle Arthur? No need. We had a good time. What's wrong? Nothing. Just met some folk. I better go speak with Dutch. Okay. Hey. You did real fine, kid. Thanks. Thanks! We got a problem. What? I just met some guys out near the river. A fella named, um... <coughs> and, uh... I don't remember the other fella's name. Ross. Milton and Ross. And, and they are employees of the Pinkerton Detective Agency. And they know about the train and they know we're here. Were you followed back here? No. They know we're near here. They want you, Dutch. They offered me my freedom in exchange, they did. Why didn't you take it? Very funny. <coughs> what do we do now? <coughs> I say we do nothing. Get here. They're just trying to scare us into doing something stupid. We have turned a corner. We survived the mountains. We just need to stay calm. And ugly, it ain't right. Oh, I forgot. You sold them out to save your own skin. Come on, that's enough. You're our boot boy now. 
Just get away from me. Here he is. Hey. Worst Living high in the hall now, in sir. History. That's good news. Yes, sir. Oh, so now it's Five me. times for us all. Hi, Charlie. That's a strange outfit. Always busy. Somebody has to do it. Air Strauss. Call me mean, but you take the prize. Pardon me, I couldn't hear you over the garishness of your attire. If you had a spine, you'd be dangerous. Leave me alone. Sadly, you're too weak to do your own dirty work. Get away from me. Good morning. Good morning, no Arthur. That's all we got. That's all that anybody has got. Dreams. Ideas. It is that or be a monkey. You're so drunk these days. If you're uncle in training, you're the one dressed like a damn idiot. Except half the charm and twice as lazy. What did I do, huh? Unless you're hard at work inside studying to I be a halfwit. Son of a bitch! Ja. Ja. Det var så alt for den her episode af Red Dead Redemption 2. Tak fordi I så med. Husk at like og subscribe, og så ses vi næste gang. For yourselves, I mean, because me... I'm going forward. Because going forward makes me...